What's up, everybody? It's Counter HD here, bringing us a brand new video today. We're going to be talking about Calvin Ridley and how he has been banned for the 2022 NFL season. So, let's go ahead and hop straight into this. Calvin Ridley. It came out that hey, they were banning him for the season due to the fact that he had made bets on the league and on the Falcons. He made $1,500 worth of bets. That's not that much. That's really not that much. For someone who is capable of putting uh, tens of thousands and he only bet a 1500 that's really low. And the NFL has come out and said that he had no involvement with the team, clarifying that they he looked into it and he did not have any insider trade or anything from the team. So my question is, why ban him the whole season? It's $1,500. And they've proven that he did not get insider help. So why did he get banned? I mean, Miles Garrett hit a guy using a helmet and got banned for like the last five games of the, of the year. So betting on your own team when you've been away from them for a year should not affect you one bit. After the, after the NFL came out with this news, Calvin Ridley tweeted and said, I bet 1500 total. I don't have a gambling problem. Then tweeted again, I couldn't even watch football at this point. And one last tweet with just, i just going to be more healthy when I come back. So that kind of just says that he has no plans to fight this. This does suck because there was a lot of talks of Calvin Ridley moving on from the Falcons and going elsewhere. So it is, uh, it does suck to see that this happened. But I think we can all agree that that is over excessive on the league. They gave someone a year ban for practically nothing. They didn't even use like one, they used less than 1% of their money. The reason I say that, I mean, this guy is making millions and millions of dollars and he put $1,500 on just a gamble. Probably stuff he didn't even win because the Falcons were that bad. But hopefully there's a hearing and they decide to shorten it to like, I'd probably say it's like a four or five game. That's me personally. But the NFL has their own way, so it's probably not going to get reversed. But hopefully there is a hearing about this and... They can come to terms on a shorter sentence. That is going to be the video. Let me know down below what you guys think. Because this is way too harsh. It, It's simply put. It just can't be tolerated. In being that harsh. But let me know what you guys think down below. Be sure to hit that like and sub button. And I'll see you all in the next one. Out, fourth quarter shorty, no call outs. Don't go to work, baby. Just call out uh, in the bedroom. All out perks on the counter. I can't wait to take them. Blunts on the counter. Can't wait to face it. Bad little bitch, yeah. She be my favorite. All my songs, they all on their playlist. I don't really know how to say it, but I'ma say it. I don't really know if she take it, but she can take it. I don't slow it down unless I'm in the matrix. Presidential brain, that bitch, like Sarah Palin.